did its best to tamp down expectations, but even so, these numbers were hugely disappointing, and they mean that far more Americans have lost their health insurance as a result of Obamacare than have gained it. Now, this is really going to ramp up pressure on the president in a big way as the White House struggles stave off Democratic defections. Nervous members of Congress who already fear voter backlash and may now be willing to join Republicans in an effort, including one this week, to change the law and prevent some of these mass cancellations. I would not want to be in a Democrat's position and vote against that. All you're doing is reaffirming the promise that the president made. And, and, you know, if there weren't millions of people, by the way, affected by this, I'd almost feel sorry for the White House at how terrible this has been rolled out at how much this law is basically built to fail. And it came as the administration's chief technology officer could not give Congress assurances that the website would be fully operational, even by self-imposed end-of-month deadline. Is the end of the month realistic? Uh, the team's working really hard to hit that goal, and that's what I'm able to say right now. Yeah, sir. So, so you, you, to, to me, that as a former web developer, that's what I was telling clients when we were going to miss a deadline. We're working real hard to, to meet it.